You'd be surprised at how many bass guys wear gloves like this, Charlie. You don't get small when you do that. Ten pounder! You like these things, eh? Just leave them right there. Oh my god. <laughs> guys, guys, I, I got it. I got it. Guys! There's a good one, eh? Man, finding these isolated reefs here and what was ice out maybe a week and a half ago, something like that. And uh, these fish are so concentrated right now. And to come out here and being nice, what, four pounders maybe, four, hopefully. Yeah. yeah. Nice fish. It's pretty fun. We're up in uh, Rainy Lake right now. We're trying to find real small ones. The big ones don't really seem to produce as many. Uh, I, mean, I mean, Mike's done it quite a bit too. So uh, kind of 10 foot rises and finding these nice flats on top of the top of the reefs here. And right now, what are we, 22 feet, yeah. 23 feet. It's gonna be in that 20, 30 range, so. Oh. Smack it? Oh yeah, I didn't even think I was there. He might be still be there. I'm just looking to see when we come into the fish here. These fish are so glued to the bottom that it's pretty hard to read on a graph, but it almost looks like if you could think of like spaghetti, like they're just spaghetti <laughs> lines. I know it's funny, but that's the way I think about it. We're out here on Rainy Lake. Ice just went out. We kind of found a smaller school of fish here. I'm just out here on Main Lake Basin again. What we're doing is we're just trolling around with a big lund here and graphing fish and when we graph them we put it in spot lock and kind of just sit over top of them and try to jig them up. Hooked up. Yeah, this is a better fish. <clears throat> Might need the net eggs. I can do that. I'm not sure. Yeah, definitely a good one. Eggsy, here it is. This is a good one. There we go. There's a bit better one, eh? So, Eggsy and I just figured out this little puzzle. The wind died down. We've been throwing tubes all day. One of our favorite baits this time of year. And we just weren't getting the bites. We're, we're, we're graphing the fish, and they're all fish like this down there. They're everywhere. <clears throat> and what we did was we went from throwing those, those bottom dragging baits to little three inch swim baits. Eggsy's got a little bit different style on, and he's hooked up. But uh, what we can kind of figure out is that with the less wind, these fish have kind of, I don't know, what, what would you call it, eggs? Just slowed right down, right? Yeah, they kind of died so, off. It was pretty apparent too, like. The reaction bite that these swim baits are causing are putting a lot more numbers back in the boat for us. And I mean, they're all different sizes down there, but we have two different swim baits on, but we're both using three eighths to quarter ounce heads. We're letting them sink. They're hitting bottom and we're just slow rolling them back and that's what uh that's what they're producing hey eh? yeah <clears throat> <laughs> well, that, oh, that one's like decent. instant. Oh, yeah. Mike's got a chunky one here. Yeah? Yeah. That's a sow. If you haven't done this, as soon as ice goes out, 
This is a riot. I mean, I don't even know how many of these we've caught so far today. And this one's actually been caught. Yeah, look at that. That's cool. Practice. That's why you practice catching your leaves, right? right? Yeah. Come back and <laughs> those are awesome. How fun is that? Sweet. Oh, <laughs> missing them. Oh, jeez. A drop shot though, something different. Yeah. It's kind of fun to mix it up. There you go. I'd say we're into them. There's nothing more fun than sitting on top of some fish. Digging them up. It's about as close to walleye fishing as you'll get, you know, little one. I mean it's just literally one after another. Oh, I can't catch a fish. <laughs> we are on the bass rod even. I figure since we're catching bass, you might as well break out the bait caster. Oh, that's a big one. Thank you, sir. I can't even see that tube. It's <laughs> right down its throat. He choked it. That's a beautiful, beautiful fish. Such a fun bite. Just grab a couple of buddies and come out here and you literally just spot lock and catch these fish all day long. That's a beautiful. 25 to 30 feet of water. Just holding tubes dead on the bottom and just wait until you feel that thunk and set the hook and fish on. What do you think, bass guy? Looks good. I'm gonna catch one. Yeah. <laughs>